Whoa! Holy moly! Put this out! 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 <laughs> Hey, hey, hey guys, how are you doing? Welcome back to Sky Factory 2. Um, so, unfortunately, um, we are dealing with a lost episode situation here. Lost episode? No! Um, yeah, basically, uh, I did some recording and it recorded with you know, without any audio. Great, because... <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. My settings got messed up when I installed uh, my new webcam for my subscriber special. So, blah, blah. Um, <laughs> uh, I don't know. Right, so, um, yeah, basically, um, what we're going to do is we're going to recap what I've done. And then I'm going to try and do something, like, maybe build something quickly with you. So, um if we go over here, do, 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 um, I made some minor updates to this just to kind of streamline it down using these glass micro blocks. I think it looks a little better. I also had to kind of separate before this pipe here just went onto the side of there. And because it was so close, it seemed to didn't want to send the lava buckets down here. Don't know why. Uh, well, I do kind of know why, but it was annoying anyway. So, um, I separated it out with this micro block here and it comes in the bottom now and, and it all works nicely. Um, so that's a minor update. Then we've got two major updates. Um, yeah, the mob farm. The mob farm now um, is, um, I put made more chests, uh, more barrels, um, and I also got loot, uh, loot bag automation online. So let's show you what we've got going first of all i've replaced our fence gate with a, an iron spike so that can be opened and closed um and that's just so that anything that doesn't die of fall of the fall damage um basically the iron spike will kill and we've got our vacuum hopper back there you can see it just there um and so i moved it there and there's our item thingy <laughs> pipe um and that let's see if we can knock some of this out um that goes down here and underneath this autonomous activator now what i've got here is a mod mod sorting pipe um and that is basically uh you make um a, a sorting pipe which is that and you put it with some redstone really cheap now the way this works is and it took me a little while to figure out what on earth was going on uh, but the way it works is it will sort items into here that match stuff that's already in here by mod so if this is empty it will put like just something in here and as soon as something goes in there then it will only put items from the same mod in there so by filling this up with loot bags, common loot bags, because, you know, who cares, um, and telling it to use the first slot only, that means there's always loot bag items in here. And, oh, there you go, you saw it work there. Um, and that basically means that the loot bags make it into here, and then that set to sneaky, right-click. So we sh it's basically shift-right-clicking into here, so it empties the loot bag into the chest, and then there is uh, another transfer node here to pull the items out. They go underneath here and back through the mod sorting pipe because sometimes you get bags within bags, the like worn out bags. Um, and then it goes off and goes into the chest system. Occasionally one skips it. Um, I'm assuming if two come through in, it, it's when two come through in rapid succession. And this autonomous activator doesn't like empty that slot in time for the second one, but you know, ho hum, it's not, it's no biggie. Um, I've also put micro blocks on the back here to make this one wiggly pipe rather than a grid of pipes. So that's a that's a thing, and it's working pretty fantastically. Getting our vibrant alloys and pulsating, pulsating iron. Gonna want some of that actually. Um, 
and obsidian, which we might use in a bit, um, and redstone, glowstone, all good stuff. Um, okay, right, so if we go over here, um, I have... Um, so the grass that we planted last episode, that spread. Um, and over here on this platform, oh, there we go. <laughs> tree in your face, tree in your face. Um, yeah, so we've got a, a couple of farms here, uh, standard MFR stuff, basically. So let's, um, uh, see if we can reveal it. There we go. Right. So we've got this little power plant here, basically the same principle as that one over there. Um, yeah, basically um, cobblestone generator um, using this kind of world interaction upgrade thing that goes around there, fills that up, which is <laughs> loud. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's making lava. The autonomous activator is grabbing it with the bucket and there you go. Awesome. Um, and then I'm using the vibrant Ender IO cable to pass power down to a planter that is below there and the harvester uh, which dumps into this chest. Uh, then I've got an item node with a filter for saplings um, and a pipe back to the planter. So when the planter is full of saplings um, they will start backing up into here. But for the moment, you know, I'm happy with that. That's fine. It will... Um, it will give me uh, plenty of wood. Uh, <laughs> and this is pretty much exactly identical. Um, so that is what I did in the episode that was not to be. Um, oh, loudness. Look at it go. Awesome. Um, so yeah, obviously I've cleared the trees out of this middle area. Which is, um, you know, it's a thing. Um, I've also got this, uh, I think I had the alloy smelter last episode, maybe. Um, which pulls from here and dumps to here um, and another sterling generator um, so yeah what I am going to do actually is I am going to I'm going to install one of the power plants um, over here um, and I think I'm trying to think of a decent place to put it I think if we pull this oh I'm not sure if these were here or if I explained the fences but I put fences in um, because on a couple of occasions <laughs> on a couple of occasions while playing tired um, I basically don't want that um, yeah basically <laughs> I was playing tired and I very 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 nearly just walked off the edge <laughs> like kind of pretty much falling asleep while playing um let's put that there and then oh no so yeah i put fences down because <laughs> would have been would have been bad uh right okay that's good let's grab this and do, 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 do. put water in that one um i wonder no and i've thought basically i've thought of a way to make this power plant probably about as compact as it can be um so yeah um hopefully right so we do that um and then we want I've got an item node, I think. Transfer node? No. Liquid node. Uh, do, 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 do. No. Okay, fine. Uh, <laughs> right, let's grab one, one, one of those as well. Um, right, let me uh, make up an item node and a world interaction node. Okie dokie, right. Um, so, yeah, what we'll do... Um, I do have... Do I have? Should have. Somewhere. Hey, nice. Um, one of those. So, um, that goes on there. 
and they go in there. Then I want no. <laughs> Um, uh, hello, I think not. <laughs> Stop that setting fire. Um, so, Matt, can we... Uh, ah, there we go. Awesome, that I should actually stop it setting things on fire just because it's uh, blocked off on all sides. Used to work that way anyway. Um, there we go. Awesome, right. So that will then start filling up. Beautiful. Um, then... We need autonomous activator. Um, awesome. Right. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to put. Uh, we're going to head on around here and go like that. And then we're going to make uh, the top an input and the side. No, that side. An output okay cool cool and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna make some ender IO item conduit con conduit uh, eh, there we go so this is pulsating iron nuggets and this conduit binder of which I still have plenty um, we will grab that, do that, sweet, right, okay, we'll grab our sterling engine, thank you, and we're going to put you here, um, we'll stick this so it doesn't join, awesome, um, and we're going to configure the back of this to pull, and the top of it to push. And then we're going to get put, put you on there and set you to you're on extract. Awesome. And you on there and set you to insert. Awesome. And then we're going to put a bucket in here is it gonna work <laughs> is it gonna work that fills up it goes into there it's gone from there it's in there waiting for enough lava to fill up again awesome um, and then we can simply run our conduit so sort of long here I guess um, Kind of low on that. <laughs> um, let's let's make some. Let's make some, shall we? Um, so there we go, and that it, that will power power our stuff and things. Um, let's see. Sweet, right? Do do do. Nice, nice. So that. Click on there, in out, eh? Hmm, okay, fine. You still waiting for nearly there? Um, cool, awesome. So hopefully, the only last thing to check is um, once we get a full lava bucket in here, that it doesn't then just kind of whiz round in a circle. Um, I think it won't. Um, from Ender IO is not a mod I've used a lot of, to be honest. Um, I did use it a little bit with sag mills, and I don't think with this set to push and using these Ender item conduits, I think I think it will only be able to get the the bucket out if it's like an outputable item. So once it's empty, kind of like how um, lava buckets go through these, like they won't come out of the bottom unless they're empty. Um, so, hey, you know, let's uh, see. This is nearly there. Pop, and it's staying there. Sweet. Sweet. Fantastic. Right, let's see. What can we build today, then? You know what would be nice? You know what would be nice? Is to have not double-clicked that. Um, 
I wonder, can we, can we make a jetpack, a leadstone jetpack? Have I got plenty of lead? I got a little bit of lead. <laughs> I've got. Mm, mm. Can we make one of those? We'll need. We'll need something to charge. Charge the thing up with. We'll need. Um, you know what, I've just watched Slip do this uh, in uh, FTB Infinity. Um, uh, do 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 do. Infuser. Infuse. Infuser. Infuser. Sweet. Right, so uh, we need leadstone energy cell. Right, okay, fine. Need redstone. Um, let's put that there. Nice. Um, Right, what do we need? Flux capacitor, copper, lead, sulfur. Ooh, uh, where do I get sulfur from then? Um, uh, huh? Leadstone? Holy moly. Holy moly! <laughs> okay, well, it's stuff we've got at least. That one, that's what I want. Sulfur. Sag mill, okay. You might have to buy make a sag mill. Oh, tell me I can grind. No, induction smelter. I don't want that. Pulverizer. Dear me. Um, right, uh, what's the sag mill cost? Uh, oh, actually, a pulverizer because that is a thing that. We need uh, one of those. So, basic machine frame, piston, copper gear, redstone reception coil, flint, and this is all stuff we can do. Do that, do that, pulverizer. Sweet. Okay, let's put that there and put that is not what I want. Ah. Whoops. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> there we go. That is what I want. Right, so output everything. Everything to the side, yeah. Cool. And input from there as well. Let's uh nice and Right, okay. You know what? We can pulverize this. You gonna feel? Really? You don't just pick up like the Ender IO stuff? Well, that's just rubbish. <laughs> okay, um. Right, what we'll do is we will grab some coal. We need to do that to get our sulfur because it's the only thing. Oh, wow. Is that noisy, noisy? <laughs> um, let's uh, do that. Um, right, so hopefully we should get some sulf sulfur out of there. I ain't go. Oh, really? You just pull in. Ah. Yeah, but. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> um, come on, give me some sulfur. Right, give us a sec while this makes some sulfur up. Right, okay, so we have sulfur, which means we can um, make this. Um, like that, and like that, is it? No? <laughs> oh, lead and redstone. Okay, fine. Uh, like that, and like that. Sweet. Um, then we need ah, we need leather. We need leather. Oh no! Oh no! I don't think I'm getting leather from anything. No. However, we are getting. We've got 15 of these. So let's hope. Two, three. Let's hope, no, let's hope that we get, 
squid. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, whoa! Holy moly! Put this out, put this out, put this out. Put this out, put this out, put this out, put this out, put this out. <laughs> come here, come here. Come, come here. <laughs> uh, that was a... Wow. Can I... <laughs> no. Don't do it, man. <laughs> okay, this is a bad place to do this. Um, oh, wow. I've got squid spawning in my thing. That's awesome. Um, <laughs> uh, okay, cool. Let's... No. Tell you what. Let's just let him... Let's run over here. Run over here. <laughs> he will... He'll go away on his own. <laughs> uh, right, let's try again. Awesome! <laughs> give me your leather. You give leather, don't you? Nice. Give me <laughs> Cool. Right. Okay. Right. Uh, to you. To you. To you. Uh, uh, there we go. Awesome. Right. Let's start constructing this in here. So there you go. They go there. Then we want lead and lead. And then we want to make these things. And so we're going to need two of those. Two of those. Two of those. Okay. Um, let's make the redstone reception coils first, or whatever these ones are. I never remember. Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, make pneumatic servos. One, two. Um, let's get some more of this. Sweet. Uh, lead, ding, copper. Uh, nope. There we go. And... Okay. <laughs> oh, wow. Right, okay. So I'm going to want... Think. Right, we need more redstone. Right. So four copper gears. Okay. Uh, sweet. Um, got more copper ore. Right. One, two, three, four. Uh. And <laughs> okay, um, uh, boom, boom, okay, right, and holy moly! <laughs> ah, so I'm gonna need four steam diamond dynamos. This is a hell of a recipe. A hell of a recipe. Need more copper. Let's go grab some more copper. Can we pulverize this? Yeah, we can. Ha, <laughs> that's sweet. I'm fairly certain we can't pulverize. Oh, that's the dust. 
What does... Oh, okay. I thought it, we wouldn't be able to pulverize the dust. What does that make? Really? Wow. Huh. Let's get rid of that. Go away. In there. Cool, right, okay, so... Two, one, two. Wah, sweet. Okay, um... So... Let's do that. 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 Lead and glass. Lead and glass. Wrong way round. Oh no, what's what goes in the middle? Ah, servos. Oh and boom and boom and oh wow that was a thing. <laughs> huh? Oh right, okay. Um Nice. Whoa. <laughs> we have flight. Sweet. Look at all the mobs in there. Look at them all. Look at them all. That is awesome. I can show off the 88%. Oh, I can show off the, the wiring. You know what? I'll tell you what. Mm, mm. Let's find out what is... The hover mode, hover mode, hover, 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 was it simply jetpacks, switch mode, C, sweet, all right, okay, it's not like a true hover, huh, okay, so there you go, you can see, in fact, I can recover this, nice, Get rid of some of this. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> cool. <laughs> so you can see how I've wired that up down there. Pause the screen. Because <laughs> you're not getting any more. <laughs> um, cool. Oh, and pigs. Awesome. Sweet. So, yeah. That is... Let's turn that boing cool um yeah that's definitely all we've got time for today um sorry about the missed episode and the work i did then um, that you missed but uh yeah unfortunately sometimes that sort of thing happens um but yes until next time guys take care of yourselves thanks for watching and take care of yourselves bye woohoo <laughs> Oh, boom. Uh.